Hi everyone, welcome to Northeast Living. I'm Mark Jennings, your host. I'm coming to you from Salco Farm in Southport, Connecticut. And ski sundown in New Hartford, Connecticut. Winterfest at Bushnell Park, beautiful West Hartford Reservoir. Well, the weather outside is certainly frightful, but the bed inside is simply delightful. That is, if you know where to go. Well, there's only one place to go for a custom bed, and that's custom sleep design. Metro PCS is opening a brand new store here in Hartford, and this is the general manager, Bruce Martin. Let's learn more from Dave, who's here to talk to us a little bit about what's going on with Hyundai these days. The sensational Broadway play Mamma Mia is coming right here to Connecticut. So Chef Gary, what are we making today? We're gonna make sauteed shrimp with a lemon thyme dill blanc, served in a fleuron, and sauteed asparagus with a black garlic. Sounds delicious. The hills are alive here in Farmington, Connecticut. The Hillstead Museum, with 152 acres, has been the hub of activity since the Pope family first occupied their then newly built country estate. That was in 1901. Today, the Hillstead has been preserved and protected as a National Historic Landmark. As a designer, it's my job to have some of the best resources. Universal Hotel Liquidators, believe it or not, is the best kept secret that you need to know about. Gail, it's so great to meet you, and what a great place you have here. Welcome, Laura. So happy to have you. Can I show you around? Absolutely. Welcome to the Connecticut Home and Remodeling Show, brought to you by the Home Builders Association of Hartford County. It's time to get organized. So one lucky family is going to get just that with their playroom. And of course, it can't happen without taking a special trip to Ikea. So, Katie, what do you think of your new playroom? This is incredible. It's better than I ever could have imagined, Mom. I cannot wait for Henry to see this room. As an author of a gardening book, I've been to many different garden centers across the country. But this place, Baggett Family Farm in East Windsor, will totally knock your socks off when you see their homegrown collection. My home, Rosebrook Gardens, is celebrating her sweet 16th birthday. West Hartford has lots to celebrate, so much so they have a yearly event for it. And that's why I'm here, to learn all about it. Okay, so I'm a little obsessed with getting organized. Now, I love closets. Big closets, small closets. I haven't seen one closet case that I haven't been able to resolve. Whenever possible, incorporate shelves, boxes, and even wicker in your design. These have both function and beauty. During the cold winter months, I'm a firm believer in protecting my hedges with burlap covering. Here in the Northeast, the winter months can be very damaging to evergreen shrubs, so it's essential to wrap them up and keep them safe from old man winter. Now, if you have a fireplace mantle and it doesn't allow for you to decorate and put your collectibles on it, here's a great idea for you. Why not expand your classy glassy decor by adding glass as a surface to put all those wonderful things on top? Can you believe it? This is my shed. Let me show you a couple great ideas to create structure with structure. Everything has a purpose and everything that has a purpose has a function. I love thinking green and whenever I could reuse, repurpose or redesign, that's what I'm all about. So I've come up with a creative project for a soap dispenser that's both fun, decorative and also makes a great gift. You want to start scraping from the top to the bottom and when you do, it's going to look like this. This will work perfectly right on top of this bottle. A well-appointed china cabinet could add elegance and poise to any environment. It can also further the decor opportunities in your home. But how can it serve for storage as well as collectibles? Let me show you a couple of marvelously simple ideas to do both. Focus on creating an interesting look in each of the different areas. Turn that into an individual vignette. Make your eye wander from one side to the other by creating a zigzag effect 
of focal points and interesting collectibles. And there you have it. 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 On behalf of everyone here at Northeast Living, thank you so much for watching. And make sure you follow us on Facebook and Twitter and let us know what you think. I'm Mark Jennings. Goodbye, everyone.